Ladies and gentlemen, federal employees, welcome back. Today we're talking about how federal retirees actually spend their time and often is way differently than what they planned before retirement. So if you're new here, welcome. So good to have you. My name is Dallin Haas. I'm a financial planner who serves federal employees just like you every single day to help you guys get the most out of your benefits, retire confident, and have the retirement of your dreams. That is the goal. So long story short, when it comes to how federal employees spend their time, people are often shocked by how much time they don't have in retirement, right? That is one consensus I saw about all the different studies I was looking at is people are shocked that they think, hey, when I retire, I'm going to have an extra eight, nine hours a day because before I was working eight to nine hours, I'm going to have eight to nine extra hours every single day. What, but what most people find is that in retirement, they're just as busy, right? Responsibilities and things fill the void, whether it's um, community responsibilities, whether it's church responsibilities, whether it's family responsibilities, things fill the void. So what people actually find is instead of having, let's say, eight to nine extra hours a day of free time, what most people find is they have maybe two or three extra hours a day of free time because the rest kind of gets filled with other responsibilities that happen, right? Maybe your kids say, hey, oh, now mom and dad are retired. They can help watch the grandkids more or whatever it is. The, the void gets filled often. And so most people find, again, this is just most people. There's obviously exceptions. And for you, who knows, right? But hopefully this is informational and helpful. So what most people find is they're surprised by how busy they are with things that just filled the void. And again, they're only looking at a couple hours of extra free time per day. Now, they've also done studies. Okay, what do federal retirees, what do retirees in general what do they spend their free time doing? And what they found is about half of the free time that retirees have in their life, they are watching TV. That's what the average retiree does with half their free time is watching TV. The other half, it's split between socializing, maybe some travel, eating, that whole thing, right? So at the end of the day, that is what the average person's retirement looks like is most of their day actually gets filled up with other responsibilities, whether it's kids, church, community, whatever, right? Things that they're like, wow, you know, I, t I talk to people that retire, my clients all the time that are retiring and retired, and almost unanimously, they are surprised by how busy they are. They thought they would just have a bunch of downtime, and it doesn't always happen. They, there's exceptions where it does, and maybe they get bored, but often that's simply not the case. And then it's up to you to decide, okay, what do I want my retirement to be? Is that what I want my to be, mine to be? Because if you do nothing, you're probably going to fall in the average somewhere, right? That's how it works for most of us. If we don't have a plan, we don't execute it, we don't put intentional thought and planning into something, we're probably going to land in the average where, hey, you're probably watching TV half your free time and the rest you're fitting in some socializing and things like that, right? What do you want your retirement to look like? That's my question for you is, it doesn't matter how other people spend their time in retirement. How do you want to spend your time in retirement? How do you make sure you make that happen? Because at the end of the day, things like TV, which are easy, mind numbing, all those things are going to be super easy to do. And they're going to be the default unless you have something else, something else that's driving you, something else you're passionate about and that you love and want to do. So long story short, Please, please take the time to be intentional about your plans for retirement. If you're not quite retired yet, think about it. Start planning. What sort of things and activities and passions do you want to do? If you are retired, I'm curious how close you are to this average situation. Do you relate to it? Maybe not. Maybe so, right? So think about it. Keep it in mind. And I hope, hope that is helpful. Please share your experiences in the comments below. It helps us all to improve, get better, and learn from each other. If you have any questions about your federal benefits, there's also a link in the description below to submit those, and we'll answer them every single week. One of our episodes are just answering your questions. So I hope that's helpful. Have an incredible rest of your day. I'll see you guys next time.